Hey guys, it's your boy Justin bringing you guys a new video today and today vi today's video uh, is an update video for you guys so you guys can see what's going on with my village and what I'm upgrading and how's it been, how's it been going. So currently I kind of put my town hall to the outside because when I had it like protected in the center um, it seemed like people would get more of my loot and whatnot and now just people just snipe the town hall and usually just leave. I haven't had anyone not snipe a town hall yet. I know there will be some asshole who doesn't, but at the current moment, it's been going well where I keep it on the outside, get the free shield, and just sit in the shield. And with the boost uh, for the event that Clash has had for like three years of Clash of Clans, having the boost on at the same time while you're in a shield is really good to stop me from having to really raid as often as I usually have to. I have to get all my new defenses that I got to the appropriate level. So right now I get this mortar about to go level five. I gotta get this air defense over here to level 5. I'm currently getting golems in 3 days. And P.E.K.K.A. in 5 days. I also have to upgrade this Tesla over here to level 3. I have to upgrade this air sweeper. And I have this wizard tower over here I have to upgrade. And then two storages, that gold storage and the elixir storage that needs to be upgraded. I got all the new walls that I got to level 7, which I, done, I did it pretty quickly. It's not that hard to do. But now I'm starting to get to level eight, and level eight walls are half a million, half a million each, and it just costs a bit, and it takes a while to get them upgrading. So that would take a while to do. I'm thinking that I might not be done Town Hall eight for like about a month and a half or two months. I'm not sure. I think like late September to early October is accurate enough to determine when I'll max out. Uh, Town Hall 8, hopefully faster if I can do it any faster, but without gymming or anything like that, it should take a while. So, right now it's going good and it's all smooth. Um, let's go into my clan. So, right now we're at 26 of 50 members. We've won 15 wars, so I think we were at 13 wins last time, so we went up to. I'll just scroll down and let you guys see all the members. Um, a lot of these members could be getting kicked depending, depending on how they attack, donations, and things like that. So I can weed out the people who are inactive or who are not good enough to be in the clan. Because I really want good attackers who are good in wars. So we can hopefully do really well in wars and win wars as often as possible. So those people who I think are not adequate enough will be getting kicked. So you can see that number dwindle down over time. So how do I plan on upgrading everything? After I get everything to where I need it, need it to be really essentially I'm probably going to start upgrading my air defenses and whatnot first because I want to get them level 6 I like the way they look and then probably start on wizard towers and then eventually the cannons and the archer towers that's at least how I plan on upgrading my defenses one thing I want to go into is my player profile and let you guys see what I've been doing so for get those goblins I only need 5 more stars which I will start doing hopefully soon I'm not sure when but I'll have a video when I complete it Nice and tidy. I'm 39 obstacles away. Go grab him at 96 million almost, which I'm really excited about. So that'll be done within a few more days after I stop sitting in shields. Basically, when the boost of the gold mines and elixir pumps runs out, I should start attacking a lot more and get that done in like a few attacks. My elixir stealing, I'm at 83 million, almost 84 million. Um, the upgrade my clan castle to level 4, I plan on doing it pretty soon because it's only a two day upgrade. I'm not sure when I will do it, but I will be doing it in the near future, hopefully hopefully, yeah, within a week. So you guys, I'm just going to go and scroll down so you guys can take a look at these all real quick. You guys can pause if you need to. So, friends in need, um, or friend in need, I'm almost at 5,000 donations. I had 1,000 this season, so hopefully it goes up, and uh, I think I should eventually... Maybe within another week I should have that challenge done, at least the second part, or the second star done. And I'll be starting on the third star. And this is just the rest right there. You guys take a quick look. And uh, that's pretty much it right now. Uh, so like I said, I'll be sitting in shields for a while. You know, taking the free shields that I can get to, you know, not have to worry about getting raided as often and keeping my loot safe, as well as this wreaking the benefit of the boosted resources like the gold mines and the elixir pumps like I said for the Clash of Clans three year anniversary so that all helps like sitting in shields and whatnot plus like I said having my town hall in the center just seemed to like people had to work for it and I ended up losing a lot of loot and I really was kind of frustrating for me so this has been going a lot a lot better for me and no one's really 
uh, scanned me basically in the sense that like they've always taken a town hall instead of just actually going and taking the town hall and then reading my base at the same time. It it seems to be re working very very well for me, so I'm gonna stick with it. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, please comment, like, and share, and uh, hope you guys have a great one. Peace.